Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a Walmart fall unboxing. I've mentioned this before, but Walmart is selling out so quickly. That this is the way that I can get this information to you guys the fastest. I will try on the items throughout the video. I'll leave any notes if the sizing is off. I do have Obi, my special guest here. I'm not sure how much of the video he'll want to be in, but it's always more fun to unbox with a dog. So he's here. And a big thank you to Scoop at Walmart for sponsoring today's video. I have several of their brand new, just dropped pieces from their holiday collection in today's unboxing. Everything's gonna be listed below in the description box, as well as over on the pinned comment section. So let's get into it. All right, we're gonna start off with some bags first and actually the very comfy sweatsuit set that I have on here is from the men's section of Walmart. I love this. I made a travel reel the other day, so I will have these pieces listed below, but they're oversized on their own. I'm wearing this just in my typical size small and I think the brown color on this is perfect. And we are starting off with a sweater. I believe this is from Scoop. I mentioned this in my last Walmart video, but when I think of this time of year, I automatically think of just a classic cream or white cable knit sweater. This is super soft. I'm not sure what the material is on this, but it's very soft. And I really like the exaggerated sleeve on this. This is not gonna be a chunky oversized sweater. It is gonna be more on the fitted side, I'm imagining. Great to wear to work. You could wear a blazer over this. In addition to the winter white cream here, it's also available in that Barbie core pink, which yes, we are still seeing from designers and it's also available in black. Okay, so in here we have this time and true set. I was so excited to get this. They are calling their four piece cozy travel set. You're getting an eye mask, a pair of socks, a scrunchie and a little travel bag. As soon as I saw this, I thought this would make a great little gift. I got it in the white and gray animal print, which does remind me a lot of Barefoot Dreams. It is soft like Barefoot Dreams, but it does come in a couple of other solids and I believe a gray animal print. And I love that this comes in its own little bag. For gift giving, I would probably give this as is, but I'm gonna bust into it. And I believe this is around $18. You also could take off the time and true piece here and tie it with a bow for gift giving. All right, and here's the scrunchie in that same super soft material, which I think scrunchies from Barefoot Dreams start at around 20 or $30. So awesome, you're getting that, as well as the matching cozy socks. The eye mask that does have a silkier material on the other side, as well as this elastic band, and then of course, you're getting the bag it all comes in that also has a soft interior so obviously great for travel i'm going to keep this in my suitcase but i'm telling you this is going to be very popular for gift giving i would not wait on this item and then in here i also have a little fall dress so this is what time and true is calling their belted utility dress it does have this front pocket as well as these oversized patch pockets it does have a matching belt. It is a completely buttoned down style. But what I really liked about it is the fabric has the look of corduroy and it comes in this gorgeous wine color. I picked this up in a small and I think I'm gonna love wearing this with styled with some taller boots. You could throw it on with tights. It is like fall in a dress. Where's my poodle? Oh. You're there. Hello there. Also, I can see my light changing on camera. I did mean to get to this unboxing a little bit earlier today, but I was completely distracted with the Ring of Fire Eclipse. So let me know below in the comment section if you guys were watching that as well. I didn't get the full ring, but we did get some of it here in Texas. So in here, I do have another very similar style dress from Time and True. It also has that corduroy look. This one though is a shorter sleeve style. It does have a little puff sleeve. It has a tiered skirt and the color on this one is more brown where the color on the previous utility dress is more of that wine red color. But the short sleeve dress style does come in this burgundy color if you're interested. It's very soft, it's nice and lightweight, so perfect if you're having transitional weather like I am. It also does have pockets. Ooh, we have some comfies in here. So these are from Joy Spun. It has the look kind of imprinted on it like a cable knit sweater, but this is pure, plushy goodness. 
It does have an elasticized waist. It does have a drawstring. It also has pockets. These are only $10 by the way. And somewhere in today's order is the adorable matching top because I have a sneaky suspicion that it is. And I also picked up these cozy PJs from Joy Spun. They did a version of these last year. They were my favorite holiday PJs. So I was thrilled to see that they brought them back. It is a two piece set in this delicious soft velour. The top is a long sleeve button down and I did go with the red buffalo check plaid, but this comes in several other patterns. Another one that I have also in these boxes as well as a solid black that's gonna look great. And the pants here are a wide leg style. They do have an elasticized waist and you do have pockets. You're getting both of these pieces for under $20. These are always one of the first holiday pieces to sell out every year. All right, so in here, I do have this two piece set from No Boundaries. This is a thin, nice and lightweight, and it does have a deep ribbing. The pants do have an elasticized waist. They are a wide leg style. And the top is this very classy, I think, mock neck, long sleeve. You're getting both pieces for under $20. I'm very curious to see how this fits. I did pick it up in a size medium, but it does come in a couple of other color options. And I do have another set from No Boundaries, another two piece set from No Boundaries in this unboxing. They have a lot of different options for that right now. And to the first pair of shoes in today's haul, these are from Time and True. They are a lug style boot. I think they're calling this a moto buckle style boot. They remind me a lot of the biker style that is really supposed to be very big and very on trend this season. I think this is a wearable way to wear that trend. And I went with the black, but they also come in a really nice cream color. You do have the thicker lug sole, like I mentioned, silver hardware on the buckle detail. You have a smaller buckle up top, and then you do get in and out of the boots with a side zipper. And I do have these in a size nine. So from the photo, I couldn't tell if this was gonna look more like a faux suede or a faux leather. It definitely is not faux suede. It's more of a faux leather look to these. And these are gonna be great with any of your casual looks. They're under 30. Y'all, I am shocked that Obi is staying still for this whole thing. But well, let's break into a big box. Okay, this is a big box of funness, starting with one of the items that I was most excited to get today, and that is the Scoop Faux Leather Vests. These look very designer. They do come in two different colors. They are more of a crop style, but oh, they feel buttery soft. And I do like that as opposed to other cropped puffer vests, the shoulder goes a little bit longer. It does also have slit pockets. You have this really nice looking faux leather elastic at the bottom, and it has buttons that do match the rest of the vest. I'm gonna throw this on real quick. I pick this up in a size small, and this is a great color brown, by the way. This is so cute. It kind of looks like a bomber jacket in a vest style. And here's the black, which is equally a great choice. And I also like that the lining, no matter which color you go with, is the same color as the outside of the vest, which is really nice. You don't have to worry about it contrasting with the rest of your outfit, but I cannot stress enough to you guys, these are super high quality. And oh my gosh, this next jacket looks so special. This is also from Scoop. And this is what they are calling their velvet tuxedo blazer. And calling it a blazer is a little misleading. This looks like a longer jacket. It's probably gonna hit me around the knee. It is a double breasted button style. And the collar here, I'm not sure if y'all can tell since it's black, but the collar here is this satin-like material, and it does also come with this little rosette pin, which you can remove if you're not interested. So the rosette is definitely having a moment, but then also pins and brooches are huge, so I love to see the trend at Walmart. It does also have that more tuxedo lapel. It has these two faux slit pockets here on the side, and the shoulders do have a slight padding. This is definitely a dressier style with the crushed velvet, a really special dress dressy coat if you're looking for that in your wardrobe. And the inside lining is also black. I just love how dressy this is. A lot of times it can look kind of silly if we have on a nicer dress when we put on our puffer jacket, although you definitely can, but it's great to have this in your closet. Although this is something you could definitely throw on just with a t-shirt and jeans. And then also here from Scoop is a more feminine top. I thought this would be great for the holidays or for workwear, and it is this front tie style. I did pick it up in the cream, but it's also available in black. And obviously what's special about it is this front bow detail, which actually you can untie this and wear it open, which 
We are seeing this all over the runway, whether it's tied, left open. And what's also really cool about it is there is a built-in, like how your pants would have belt loops. There is a built-in neck loop I guess we could call it. Um, so the tie is actually gonna stay in place, which I think is a great detail. It does also have hidden buttons here in the front. I loved this cream color, but it's also available in black. And of course you can wear this to work, throw it on with some jeans for date night. And this top, by the way, you guys, is $22. And then up next, also from Joy Spun, is this nice lightweight robe. Pretty much any robe style I see from Joy Spun, I go ahead and order and try out, and I'm never disappointed. This one I picked up in a small, and it's pink with black piping. Comes in a lot of color options though. I know off the top of my head, it comes in gray and black. And this is 95% cotton with 5% span. So it does have a really nice stretch to it. And I think this is perfect in the morning as you're doing your makeup. Cause it's not a fleecy, necessarily cozy robe. It's more of a functional robe of, I need to make myself some breakfast. I need to put on my makeup. I think it would be perfect for that. It also would make a nice travel robe because it's not too bulky. And this is definitely not a long robe style, but it doesn't look like it's gonna be super short either. It's something kind of in between and this is under $20. All right, and I already know what this next item is. This is a faux leather puffer jacket. This is a brand new style from Scoop. And obviously I love the faux leather detail. I have gone in on faux leather styles from Walmart this year. But this is very unusual looking with the kind of half quilted, which is really on trend, half ruched look to the jacket. And it does have silver hardware, it's a zip front, and it does also have black linings. This jacket's only available in black, by the way. And it's a little bit more fitted than I thought it was gonna be. It does have slip pockets. Kind of assumed this would be a little bit more oversized. I do like the way it fits though. I'm seeing this with tight turtlenecks. You could wear this with your favorite bodysuit. Throw it on with some dark jeans. Like most scoop pieces, I think it looks very designer. All right, so in here is another pattern of the long sleeve joy spun PJ sets that I shared. And this one, I just loved the green and pink plaid. I think it's kind of a fun, more whimsical take on holiday colors. So it's the same wide leg pant and matching long sleeve button down. If you're someone who likes to go more pink for the holiday season, this is a good one. So this is from Time and True. They are calling this a sweater cape. I wouldn't really consider this a cape. It's not quite a shawl. It's more of just an open front short sleeve cardigan. This is a one size fits all style. It does have these nice oversized pockets in the front. There's no hardware, there's no buttons. As soon as I saw this, well one, I thought this was perfect for more of a Texas fall since it's short sleeve, but it also just looked like something nice to keep at your desk, at your chair. Definitely a longer style with a side slit and it is a high low, so it will be perfect with your leggings. I did pick this up in the tan color, but this is also available in a green and a black. Okay, I had to work hard for this next item. They're a mixed media sweater and the link just keeps appearing and disappearing. I was finally able to get my hands on it. This comes in so many colors. I went with the white, but it also comes in olive and a red. That's great for the holiday season, but in general, red is supposed to be very on trend this season. So just putting that out there. And this sweater is $18. It has all different type of stitching from more diamond, harlequin, to more of that open loop, but everything is tonal. It feels nice. Nice. I did get this in a size small, so I'm expecting, again, this to be more fitted, not like a chunky oversized sweater. And then in here, I do have this two pack of long sleeve mock necks from No Boundaries. I did size up to a medium in these because they are supposed to be a fitted style, but I didn't want them to be too tight. You can probably see better in the brown here, but it does have a rib detail super lightweight. They're actually quite soft. It's just gonna be a great basic for this season. You can wear this on its own. You can layer it up, put your moto jacket on over it, your blazer. These are actually look great with the puffer vest that I showed earlier. So keep it in mind for any of your vests this season. And I did go with the black and brown pack, which this is a great neutral color, by the way. Neutrals can be quite hard, but this is kind of something in between a mushroom and a taupe. And under this link, there are seven different color combos and you're getting both of these for just under $16. That makes these like eight bucks a piece. All right, let's bust into another box here. I have absolutely no idea. Okay, so in here is the matching top to the tonal plush joy spun pants that I shared earlier. 
So it is that same really pretty white kind of imprinted cable knit. All right, so I was mistaken. I thought I just ordered the little hoodie that you guys are seeing here, but actually I was ordering the set. So under this link, you are getting the hoodie with the cute embroidered little teddy bear in the corner, which no matter which pattern you go with, it does have some sort of embroidered design in the corner and the matching pant. The pant actually is slightly different from the pant that you get in an individual two pack. It is quite cute. And the pants still a jogger style with an elastic at the waist, still has pockets, but they are different from the individual link that I ordered. It does have more of a ribbon drawstring. Whereas if you order it in the two pack, no drawstring. And if you're someone who likes to sleep in a tank top or a short sleeve top, which I honestly am in the same way, definitely keep the pants in mind because you can get the, just the bottoms for under $10. And when I was ordering this from the website, I saw Joy Spun also has a really cute pink and white plaid that says stay cozy, which, you know, this time of year, all I want to do is be cozy. And my next two items are on the sportier side. They're both from Avia. This first jacket though looks so nice. I saw something similar from Lululemon that does have a hood to be fair, but it has that same horizontal quilted look for over $200. It's kind of something in between like a thin athletic zip up and an actual jacket. This sportier kind of quilted jacket is a zip up style. It does have silver hardware. It does also have these side slit zipper pockets here and it does have a bungee draw cord so you can bring in the waist on this one. And yes, it does also have thumb holes. Really nice looking jacket. I have it in a small and it's definitely gonna be more on the fitted side. But this is under $25. I think this is a great find, whether you are throwing this on to go on your hot girl walks, you're wearing this to go drop your kids off at carpool. This is a great find and it's under $25. A few moments later. All right, I had to phone a friend, you guys, and go look in my recent in-store haul from Walmart. And I remembered that I had these more flare yoga pants style athletic pants from Avia. I have these in a size small and they are also in the color Wild Mushroom. Oh, that is gonna look really nice together. What I like about these is they do have a nice wide band here, so you're gonna feel very tucked in. You do have one pocket here on the side and they do also have a side split at the hem, which is very on trend. And these were, oh, these were only $16. I love a monochromatic athletic look. I think it always looks more expensive. Oh, okay, so this next item is a pair of pants that hopefully does match a cropped hoodie that's also in today's order but this is a velour wide leg pant also from Avia. They do have a drawstring at the waist. I picked these up in a small and they have pockets. They also have that trendy side slit. I got this in what they're calling winter white. So it's a little bit creamier of a white, but these are also available in black and they are under $17. I will circle back to these assuming we find the top. So what is probably a totally unnecessary find for me living in Houston, Texas, but I had to have these. If you live where it is cold, please order these, use these immediately. They are these earmuffs from Madden NYC. I went with the tan color. Um, it also comes in pink, white, and black. And the headband part of this does look like tweed. It has this awesome oversized faux fur earmuffs. Y'all, I love these. I think these are so cute. I'm gonna have to find some snow just to have a place to wear these. Obi, what do you think? Do you like them? Do they make my head look big? They make a great gift, a stocking stuffer. Again, these are $10. All right, we have a couple more bags and then I have one big box left. Oh my goodness, I hope my Aunt Tammy is watching today's video because I saw her this last week and she looked adorable wearing this exact dress from Time and True. It is a long sleeve style, or actually I think that's gonna be a three quarter sleeve and it does have little button detail on the sleeves. It's a button down style that does have a tiered skirt. I love the colorway of this dress, but what I think makes it look so special is the thread of metallic. We are seeing metallic from all the high-end stores, high-end designers, so I love to see this on a time and true dress. This one's $20 and under the same link, there's several different plaids. This is one though that if you can't find it online, definitely check in stores, they should have it. And I do have that in a small. Y'all, this next sweater I ordered so fast. First of all, it's a chenille sweater, so it's gonna be nice and soft, which it is, but I loved the color on this. I don't know if they're calling this pumpkin spice, but to me, 
This looks like pumpkin spice in a sweater. Oh, okay, we have looked it up and actually Walmart is calling this cinnamon spice. So I wasn't that far off, but this sweater does have a crew neckline. It does have a slight exaggerated puff at the sleeve. Oh, and now that I'm looking at it, I did size one up in this. So I definitely was going for that oversized tunicky look. And that sweater does come in six colors. So this next top is from Joy Spun and I actually got it to match some really fun Christmas Nutcracker pink joggers. I don't believe that's been delivered yet, but I will flash it up on the screen because I know that's one that's gonna go really quickly. Again, especially if you're into that pink theme Christmas, but this is a great long sleeve top. And this is a rayon span blend. It feels great. Joy Spun is calling this a long sleeve sleep top, but I would wear this out of the house. I'd throw this on with some jeans and call it a day too, but it is nice and lightweight. So it's definitely something that you can sleep in. And I really like the stitching detail on it. So you do have this cross stitch here in the front. You also have stitching at the sleeve and it does have this banded hem on the bottom, but it's not gonna be too tight because it does have side slits. I love this pink, but it does come in eight colors and it is under $13. All right, y'all, we are down to the last box. Let's see what we got. All right, so I see why the box was so big. I have several different scoop coats in here. This first one I thought I was gonna like so much that I got it in both colors, and it is more of that oversized wool dad coat. I'm very curious to see what this looks like on. And this is just a classic style. Scoop is calling this faux wool. It has a great feel to it has a slight, and I mean slight padding in the shoulder. It does have two buttons here, and then these are faux slit pockets. Oh, actually, you know what? These are like suit pockets, so I, you can bust into these and open them up. It does have a notched collar. It's just a wardrobe essential if you do not already have a wool coat in your closet. And as much as I know I'm gonna use the black, y'all, this color, which I think they're calling iced coffee, which is kind of like an off camel color, is gorgeous. This one does have tortoise buttons for the double buttons here in the front. This is a beautiful coat. Oh, it does also have the slit in the back, so I'm sure the black one is the same way. And I got both of these in a size small. I can already tell that they are going to be oversized, which is really the trend that we're seeing. I think this is gonna look quite nice with my Walmart sweats that I currently have on. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I'm in love with this coat. This might be my favorite item of the haul and that's saying a lot. This is definitely a long style. This is mid calf or even lower, which I'm 5'2", so definitely keep that in mind. But the longer coat styles, like I mentioned, are the trend, so I love to see this from Walmart. And you guys might recognize this next dress. Scoop did do a version of this in the spring in green with purple flowers. This fall version is this beautiful deep purple with blue flowers. This is more of that crinkly material. It has a sheen to it, like a satin or a silk. I did get this in a size small and it is a long sleeve style, has a little bit of a modified V neckline. It does have an elastic at the waist as well as a matching fabric belt and it is a handkerchief style dress. This is the exact same dress as the spring one. This is also available in a solid black that I think would be beautiful for this time of year. And you can wear these with tall boots, throw it on with some heels. It's one of those dresses that pretty much has you covered whether you are going to an event or a nice dinner. And it's a very flattering style on everyone. And I couldn't wait to get this next jacket in. This is also from Scoop. It's kind of like a bomber style jacket, definitely has a little bit of that aviator look, and it does have the faux fur trim. I got it in the brown, but under a separate link that hadn't dropped yet, there was also a black version that does have black faux fur that's gonna also match a lot. This is gonna be more of a crop style. It does have these slit pockets here in the front, and I'm not quite sure what to call this. It's kind of like something in between a shirling and a faux fur, but the entire inside lining of the jacket is that material. So I do think it's gonna be nice and warm. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. It's also a zip up style if I didn't mention that. And it does have these nice oversized pockets, but it is more cropped. You can see it does hit me a little bit higher. I'm definitely getting the Aviator Top Gun Tom Cruise vibe, but with the faux fur detail. Oh, and the debate is over. We looked it up and it does say it's a Sherpa lining and it looks like burnished leather, like your favorite old couch, but it actually is a faux suede that is really soft. 
And speaking of very soft things, I do have this time and true little furry faux fur zip up. I got this just for fun to wear around the house. Although I definitely could go anywhere in this, go run errands, go to Walmart. I got it in the more winter white color, but it does come in a black, a really pretty chocolate brown and a pink, I think. This is a zip up hoodie style. It does have this little draw cord detail in the front and the inside of it is the same color. And this hits me at the waistline, so it's not quite cropped, but it's not long either. I think that is very adorable. And I know this is gonna be great for my climate. It's lightweight enough, but it's gonna look great with casual outfits, which I have a pretty casual everyday wardrobe, so this is gonna match quite a bit. So this next top from Scoop is either gonna be one that you love or you hate. I don't think there's gonna be a ton of in between, but it is this long sleeve ruffle front top. I did get it in the cream, but another one that I think also comes in black. And this is the button down style that does have covered buttons. And this is a shirt that you can dress way up, but honestly, looking at it now, it just reminds me so much of Jerry Seinfeld and the puffy shirt episode. <laughs> So I will have today's secret emoji in honor of Seinfeld be the TV emoji. Leave me that below in the comments and let me know if you've seen the episode that I'm talking about. Do we think it looks like Jerry's puffy shirt? Do we think it looks fabulous for the holidays? Let me know. And this next top is also from Scoop. It is a long sleeve mock neck style. What makes this top a little unique though from just a typical black mock neck is that it's a lacy style and it is see-through. So this is one that you're gonna wanna wear with your bralette or a tank top, something underneath, something along those lines. And it's definitely on trend with the more sheer styles to the mesh styles that we've been seeing. It does also have two buttons at the collar and a little keyhole detail at the back of the neck. And I think this is actually a pretty versatile wear. You can wear this right now with your faux leathers, your coated denims, wear it through the holiday season with some skirts, but then get it right back out for New Year's Eve with your sequins jogger, sequin skirts. This one is gonna be a fitted style. It is $20 and it also comes in cream. And this is the other set that I mentioned earlier from No Boundaries. It is a two piece set. So you're getting both pieces for under $20. And the bottoms are this ribbed wide leg pant style. They do have the elastic at the waist. And this great neutral color that No Boundaries is calling Mocha Delight. It is very soft. It's thin, but not see-through. And the pants do have a slit at the hem. And the top is this long sleeve zip up style. It does have a collar. You can wear this zipped up like how they're showing it as a top, but probably right now I would wear this open with a little tank top underneath, but it does also come in three other colors. And last up, another one that is just gonna be perfect for the holiday season is this crushed velvet skinny pant. These are very lightweight. Think like a jegging material, honestly. They have some stretch to it. It does have a functional button with a zip fly. So this style doesn't have front pockets. It does have back pockets, but also no belt loops. And since there's no front pocket, it's gonna lay nice and flat. I picked this up in black because I was unsure how the fit would be. And it does have number sizing, by the way. I do have these in a four, but it also comes in a really fun gold and purple that would look amazing if you just go all out, throw it with a blazer. And if you're not gonna commit and wear this with a stiletto heel, like I feel like these pants really deserve, you can definitely wear these with a boot, maybe even a taller boot style especially since they're a skinny pant, they're gonna be perfect for that. I think these are really fun and they're $26. All right, y'all, that does wrap it up. I feel like we did a lot of damage here. Everything will be linked below, like I mentioned, as well as linked in the pinned comment section. A big thank you to Scoop at Walmart for sponsoring today's video. And if you love Walmart, be sure to hit that subscribe button. There is a lot more Walmart headed your way. And be sure to follow me over on Instagram where I share Walmart finds daily. You can find me at Madison Payne Style. Thank y'all so much for hanging out with me and Obi, who has now disappeared. But we really appreciate it. And we will see y'all in the next one.